Hi guys, um, yes, before you ask, I am in my pyjamas, and yes, I am very comfortable, but this video is not about pyjamas or comfortable clothing, it is about what I got at the MCM London Comic Con, and I did consider adding what I bought at the King's Cross uh, Harry Potter shop, which was a keyring I bought for my dad, but I didn't think that was appropriate for this video, since it should entirely focus on what I got the, at the MCM London Comic Con. So that is what it's going to be, and it's going to include freebies and possibly links to where you can get the similar stuff that I bought if there's like, um, you know, the business cards, which most of them did have business cards and they're like stuff where you can get them, so that should be good. I'm going to start off with what you get at the entrance, which is this little doohickey. I'm not sure if is that in frame, yeah, is it in frame, I do you know, I can't. This is a lovely show guide and it has the lovely Daniel Radcliffe at the front in his new film Horns. He was there on Friday and Saturday but I was only able to go on Sunday but still this is very good. It's a very nice book and it's filled with lots of awesome stuff. I just saw Dead and Alive when I... yeah Dead or Alive I saw it when I flipped through. Hmm. This is also another freebie. I'm just trying to get it without <laughs> everything else toppling over and it's a Pikachu hat. And um, yeah, uh, it also came with, uh, this was free, and it also came with a few Pokemon trading cards. I had three, I'm not sure where I've put it, but they're somewhere. The, I really love this, it's the next thing I bought, and I'll probably take it out for you to see. I bought these at, oh, Dragon's, Dragon Dreads is the website. I'll put it in the links, and it's a Peter Pan necklace, let's just... Try and I'm not sure if you guys can see that, but it's really detailed. I'm sorry if I'm shaking, and it's just it's very small. But yeah, this is a Peter Pan necklace. I got this, and um, I also got uh, a green eggs and ham one. I'll take it out so you can see it a bit better. Oh. <sighs> sorry, this is really fiddly. I didn't realize it would be this fiddly. Oops. <laughs> And this is the green eggs and ham one. If you can see that. And uh, those two necklaces were five pounds each. And I think that was a very good price. I mean, they're very like quirky necklaces. I really like them. So the both necklaces each were five pounds. Oh, this was free. It's a lovely bookmark. And the art on her store was very beautiful. I'll leave the link down below because uh, her stuff's on the back of this. I I visited this really cute and quirky store, and it had and they gave us this bag, and it was all and it was all beans. Everything was styled in like the fashion of beans, and it's so cute. I'm not sure if you can read it, but it says Evil Hair Day because that's the website. And look. That is so cute, and I'm going to be using this bag so much, like, oh. And this is what we got from, this is what I got from the shop. I got this Loki badge. And this Adventure Time uh, postcard. And my friend actually bought these for us. She, they gave her... Four of these postcards and three badges for five pounds, and I think that was a really good price, and they were very nice. And only later that day did I realise they had t-shirts, and I was so upset because I wanted to buy t-shirts, and my parents, they bought t-shirts, and I was like, oh. And the t-shirts the were only a pound, and I was like, oh my days. I bought another badge, and this, this, I thought this was really cute and quirky, I don't know. Uh, a duck and a target, and I thought it was really nice. It was very cute. It was only 50p. Very cheap. I saw, uh, when we went there, there was a store selling all of these um, original prints and stuff of the Harry Potter designs. And the original person who designed all of this stuff was there selling their stuff. And it was just amazing. They made Mordor's map. They made Bertie's Bots of Every Flavoured Beans. They did all the designs. And I was just... 
I was astonished. I couldn't believe that they were there. And it was like, it was cool. I think they have a website. I'll link it down below. I got this for my sister. And it's an Adventure Time comic book. Adventure Time! Come on, grab a friend. Let's go to the very distant land with Jake the dog and Finn the human. The fun will never end. It's Adventure Time. I had to do that. It had to be done. And yeah, I got her this magazine and it, obviously she hasn't opened it yet. She'll probably open it in time. I also got my sister... Oh, I, f I didn't mention. That Adventure Time comic was only £2. And I also got her this. And it's a hardback uh, Captain America comic book because that's her favourite superhero in the Marvel franchise and it's uh, really nice you can tell it's new because the pages are sticking together and it's squeaking like it's never been touched I'm not sure if you can hear it but it's like squeaking like quite a lot but yeah this was only four pounds and I believe on the cover yeah it says on the cover it's that much but I only bought it for four pounds because it was on sale. So that was nice. And I got t shirts too. And oh, I'm so happy about all of the t shirts I bought. But yeah, look. My neighbor Toshiro top. I just had to get. I I under I underestimated how big their top sizes were, so for all the tops I chose medium that I bought. And then when I got home, and like looked how big they were, <laughs> they were huge. So I was just like, oops. <laughs> but yeah, this is my Totoro top, and I also bought a Princess Mononoke top. And. Those two, I think they were uh, 12, wait no, I think they were 13 pounds, no, 15 pounds each, but they were two for 25, so I got two tops for 25 pounds. And then I went to the ASDF shop, and I got tops from them as well, and I got Mind Turtle. Yeah, Mind Turtle, and I got Jasmine the Moon Bear. How did I get here? The end. There we go. And I absolutely, their tops are like so cool. And um, that was, I think it was seven pounds each, but you can get two for 15 pounds. So I got those. And also nearing the end, I got these tights and although it says seven pounds on there I got it for five because it was nearing the end of the day and I only had like I hardly had any money left so they let me have it for five so that was very kind of them so I got it for five and last but not least my alpaca I really wanted to buy this last year, but I didn't have enough money, so I had enough money this year, and I bought it straight away. And this one was £25. And I was really happy to get it, and I called it Ralfred, a mix of Ralph and Alfred, suggested by my friends. They suggested to mix the names, because I wanted to call it Ralph, and I wanted to call it Alfred, but not both. So I mixed it up. And it's so cute, and I'm really upset, though, because I've broke it. You may wonder, what have I broken on it? It looks perfectly fine. The head is still on. But wait, I did break it. I, long story short, I fashioned it on my head like a hat and danced around. I lo The balance on it was lost. It fell, it crashed onto the ground, and its, its necklace thingy broke. It broke. I'll show you. It says, Alpacasso Fresh. And it broke, and I had to tape it back together. And I was so upset, but like, I will take care of it, and I'm very happy to have bought it. There were so many people with alpacas there, and yes, happy to have bought it. 
And that is your video. <sighs> I'm, just, I'm still upset, but still very happy to have bought it. Bye guys, thank you for watching.